Hey y'all, it's Queen Tingling on here. I have decided to start posting workout videos again for this pick three. And, um, uh, hey, if we happen to do a pick four in there, that's great. But it seems like I've been seeing a lot of, um, uh, people out here want more workout videos and new techniques. I really haven't learned anything, um, that new. Most of everything's kind of old. But, you know, for the past year, it's been a year since I've even made a video. I've been tracking these numbers and watching patterns, you know, that because they had the change in the system a while back where they changed the companies and all that were dealing with the pick three and pick four lotteries and all that with the whole South Carolina lottery system because of the thing with the Christmas trees last year. You remember that when ever, I wished I had got a hold of one of them tickets, you know, where the people had went in the store, I think it was on Christmas Day, and had bought um, their numbers and had got the add-on, add-a-play, and everybody kept getting Christmas trees. And I think, golly, it was like umpteen million dollars at the end. The lottery ended up having to pay out these people. You know, gosh, I wish I could have gotten myself in on that but you know I didn't I was going to get going to go down there that day and play but you know you just lose confidence in numbers and I had so much stuff to happen last year that just like blew my mind away but we missed out on that but it's okay though our turn going to come up so since that company the new company has taken over you know I've been noticing new patterns and stuff and like tonight, you know, I've done workouts for the past several days. The same workouts I've been doing um, in the other videos. Because you see my 646 workout right there. The 031 is the Saturday evening pick. That's Saturday, November 24th, 2018. The pick number Pick three number was zero three one. So this is what I'm predicting for uh, tomorrow evening, which is I wrote down those few numbers right there. I haven't really wrote anything else down. I'm trying not to write a whole lot of numbers down because I think it's kind of ridiculous whenever you end up going down there and spend a whole bunch of money on a bunch of numbers and don't hit. Now this thing is random. They truly are random. I've been hitting. Um, usually every draw, I kid you not, every draw, I at least get two numbers right, but I haven't gotten three numbers right, because it's all random, <laughs> and there's no way anybody can predict what the number for the next draw is going to be, you might get two of them right, you might get one of them right, but you're not going to get all three of them right, because it's random, so I mean, if you do, hey, you're, you hit it, you're a winner, whatever. But right here is where I had, you see where I've highlighted my numbers. This is, this is for uh, Sunday, November 25th. The date number turns out to be 6. Okay. So what I want you to look at right here on the 646 workout that I did, I highlighted the 6, which is the date number. And I've been noticing here lately that somehow or another, it's also connected to the date. So, the date, you know, is 20, the 25th. So, you see it right there underneath that second six. Underneath the second six in the first row, you see where the two is. And in the second row, underneath the one, you see the five. It's the 25th. So I'll tell you one good number would be all those numbers right there in between above that five. Um, I would even say three seven one would be great for more. I'm sorry, I got there. No, I don't. I don't have that wrote down. I'm gonna write that down. Let me write this down right quick. Ugh. Hold on. Right. Get down here and write this down. Three seven one. That's another prediction for tomorrow night. 
uh, is the 371. Of course, there's 373. Um, the odd thing about it is, is that in tonight's draw, there's a zero and there's a one. Usually, after a zero, you usually get a double. So, it's either going to double out. Let's see what I would say it would be. Alright. It could be 033 or... Where's my... Might be 177. I was looking at that 033 right there. But... Now it also could flip, so let's flip that around. Uh, if it was a flip, it would be five, eight, six. So at five, eight, six. You see the six, the eight, and the five right there? I bet you. And I'll tell you another good number for tomorrow night would be to play with that two, five, eight. Because for some reason, every time an 8 pops up, the next draw, a 2 will pop up in behind it, or vice versa, one way or the other. Uh, actually, 2 is consecutive to the 8, because if you add 2 to the 8, that equals 10, which 10 you know, in lotto math, there's no 10, it just goes back to 0. So, I would suggest that too, that... Uh, Five two eight sounds really good. Yeah, you know, only in this pick three and pick four stuff, I can only give you sets of numbers that are good draw numbers. I can't pinpoint any one number that may hit because, like I said, all this stuff is random. You see right there um, in this first workout, this workout right here. All right, what we're just talking about. Um, Two five eight, right there. All right, it's not in that one, but zero three three is up in that top. So, and that's why we're looking up here. And a lot of times, I notice that on these workouts uh, like this, when it hits a double, you're not going to get all your numbers in the row either. So. I'm just looking right here, like, like that, right here, um, in this workout here, you see the six in the first row at the bottom, then you see the two and the eight, all right, you see the nine over there beside that five, that nine might, could make that five and that eight flip, we would, that right there would give you a zero, three, three, you understand what I'm saying? Nine is a flip number. Nine. Hold on a minute. Let me see if I can. I'm stupid. I'm going to show you something. I'm going to show you something right here. It's just hard to hold this thing right here. It's really hard to hold this um, paper. Nine will make a number flip. All right. Like. I'm going I'm I'm to write it down first. And, and then I'll show you in just a second what I'm talking about. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, zero. All right. Somebody told me one time. You see what I'm saying? There's, I got my nine wrote down. Like I said, nine is a flip number. Now, what's going to happen if you send a nine beside two or under two, it's going to probably flip that two over to a seven or the three over to an eight or the four over to a nine or flip that five over to a zero, same thing. Flip that one over to a six or vice versa. So you got to be kind of careful with that with playing that nine number. I'm telling you, this uh, lottery thing is very, very tricky. Very, very tricky. I've been studying this for a pretty good while. 
And I pretty much know about what I'm talking about. You know, yesterday and today both. Actually, th this afternoon for midday, oh my God, I had picked, um, what was it? Let me see what my number was. The 318 is what the draw was. I don't know if you can see that or not. People have been complaining about me not writing. Oh, I can't hold my paper still. Um, about some of my writing not coming out dark enough where they could see it. But you see right there at that top tic-tac-toe box, 318, that's the number that came out for midday Saturday today. I predicted it was 913. Just one number on. Like, dang. Just one number off. And then for today, I didn't even really get close, but I did get the one and the three. Actually, you see right down here? Wait a minute. No, wait a minute. There you go. That was for this evening. And it came out zero. One three or zero three one, what was that? Yeah, zero three one. So, if I had, yep, that was my prediction for this evening was that nine one three. Had I went one more number up and not put that nine, put a zero instead, I would have nailed it for tonight. And is it hey, Queen Chicken gets better and better every day, every day on this pick three stuff. You'll see more videos out here. From me um I'm hoping to get better equipment and get better way of writing this stuff down I've been doing a lot of changes and stuff here in the Queen's Castle here lately this is crazy <laughs> I need to start picking that pick four again too but uh, y'all have a good evening this is the Queen Chingling and I will see you later bye